Hello everyone and welcome back to Transport Fever 2. This is Neoberg and we have just put in a gargantuan line through that goes from Lower Shilden over to Shilden to Shilden North <laughs> to Upper Winsford and then over to Tring North and then up to our Helsham Horn uh, cargo city in uh, cargo interlink station. So what we want to do now is on the other side of this connect through down this way. So this is going to be a fairly tricky one. Um, well, I say that it probably isn't actually going to be very tricky at all. Um, so what we need to do is connect up down this way. We've got a few. Uh, things to connect in, including um, a forest, some a sawmill, um, a farm, iron ore, and tools factory, as well as coal ore. So, uh, without further ado, um, I'm going to crack on with that. So, what we need to do is come across the river from this side um, in a fairly uniform way. So I'm just going to continue this along and then from here split off into here. So that should then effectively go across the river and into a tunnel quite neatly. Um, where we can then come down here with our uh, cargo stop. Now, bear in mind, the um, Sh Southwold's actual uh, residential zone is mostly at the water, um, so we don't have to worry too much about uh, affecting it here, but we have a lot of traffic coming through, and... Um, that's probably going to be the hardest thing to sort out here but we'll probably just put in a bridge um, or something over the top and that should be fine so we're going to put in a few stations along this route we'll put in one here and then we'll put in one here and then we'll have one last train station down this end. We need to take out that road. In fact, we can connect in this road. Instead, so we're going to need a train line going off in this direction and we will need to remove the road here so if we just expand this so we want this to be at least two out. And hopefully if we put a connection there that may connect in, it doesn't quite, does it? But if we connected this in, then it wouldn't necessarily connect into the far, the f food uh, processing plant up here. So, swings and roundabouts. Um, that's bizarre, it actually comes back through Winsford. Um, that's pretty crazy. So, over here, we want this to be a larger train station. Uh, 
same over here we want this to be a larger train station going straight through and then we'll have A road either side which will connect in uh, we might as well get rid of this as it's going to become defunct and then we can remove that line and remove out the stuff that's in the way here so we want this train line to go through relatively flat. So we'll take it down till, in fact, if we keep it flat, does it tunnel at that point? Yes, it does. Right, so we'll adapt this road. So that we can uh, put that in a little bit better. In fact, we'll clean all of this up while we're at it. Alright, so train station wise we need that to stay flat up to that point. Over here this is going to be removed. So that te temporary line <laughs> can now go. It's no longer needed. Um, so we're going to connect this through here and this in here and then at this point it will cross over like so will hopefully not uh, affect that train line there in fact it might be easier to come through from this side staying relatively flat because hopefully this should be below this other one is not oh crap I wish you could select what you want to remove so you don't have to fight the <laughs> fight the trees <laughs> to try and remove stuff so we're gonna need to go from there we're not going up if we're staying flat it's going to interact with this one so we need to go slightly down and then hopefully if we connect these two in it doesn't interact with that one it's really hard to tell whether there's a crossing there or not we don't want a crossing um, I don't think there is one it's close but I think it goes underneath 
There's no way for us to tell until we have trains going for it, which is really annoying. So this side is all hooked up. We just need to connect up this stuff again. So what we'll do is we'll continue that through. Maybe just try connecting it up there. And if we lower it, at some point this bridge should start to, it's not doing it, is it? out that's a really steep bit um, so then we can connect in probably over here is a bit better through here don't we um, so that's going down there if we keep it flat maybe even raise it up it should bridge So then that should allow for a better connection through. Um, it's tricky. Maybe we need to put in a bit of a better connection through to like Hailsham and um, Southwold altogether. Uh, we want the road here to connect, continue through. So this one would be connecting up there. And then I don't know what has happened here. But ideally we want this to continue through as it was. Um, sort of like so. Hopefully that should serve a bit of a better connection. And then if we did these roads being, oh, what's happened here? There we go. Oh, may be able to do something here. Um, so if we delete this back, can we go underneath here?
So this might actually provide a much better route through for Hailsham, considering this is like the main road as well for Hailsham. And then maybe we can connect in these roads here and if we did maybe like a straight road through that could connect up that side. There's no, nothing saying that this needs to do such a curve. It can continue through here, maybe even connecting down here. with you as long as that connects here it's not an issue um, what this road is doing, I have no idea. Ideally we want this to continue through. Like so, in fact this could connect in there. down that way, take that out, connect this through here, then we've got a few different roads down that way, which will hopefully the connections through. This line needs to continue through, which it now can. This is such a long line. Pretty nuts. Uh, I don't know why that's going on number one. We want that on number two. Do we? Hold on. What's going on here? So that's correct, and then this one, surely this needs to go on to, oh, uh, no, 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 not there. There 
There we go. And then that's that line all set up, ready to go. Uh, um, so we just need to put connections in where there aren't any, such as down here. It's a bit of a shame that this isn't connected to the farm. Um, we might be able to do it actually if we took this out and then did maybe like a road here. So we would need to connect that down at this point and then put in some more steps. It's very close to it, but it's not quite connecting in. Just trying to think what else we could potentially do. Um, Did a bit more of a di like direct road down. That might do it, but again, it would remove some farm fields, which is a bit of a shame. But I think it's worth it if this connects. Ah, oh, it doesn't quite connect. That's pain. Um. I mean, we can totally make this work, but it does mean that we'll have to rework things a little bit around here, which wouldn't necessarily be such a bad thing. So if we just take out these connections, take out this road, And did a bit further over of a connection here. So once again, we need to expand this. Uh, like so. And then we can also have connections through here, which may arguably be better for anyway. either side of it. One of them being this main route through.
Right. There we go. That connects in. We'll do a road down this side. That will connect in. May even be able to go. Nope. <laughs> connect that in there. Connect this down here. And then connect this route down here, which would be a little bit more direct actually. So those two are connected, these are connected, for argument's sake I'll just connect in this to here, then we should be able to even connect this up a little bit better. more of a direct route through down to Winsford then and then over here have an interesting little connection through going to cause collisions with the bridge pillars so we may not <laughs> that connects up that factory this is all connected up Sweet. Uh, what's up with this line? Uh, this one's having issues. Why is it on number nine? No, wait. Oh, it's because we. <laughs> it's because we haven't put in the train tracks again. Then we do a crossover here. So at number nine, it can also go to number two. And at number one. It should also be able to go to number two as well. So that's all connected up now. We just have to actually connect it through. Um, so we need gondola, flat car, um, box car. Oh, and um, Even tank car by the looks of it, but tank car doesn't really go to everywhere. It's more just down here. So maybe we could do the tank car return 
by itself. So if we connect this here to signals one way and no one way there and on this side Probably do a similar thing because this is the only place that it would need to go down to with the crude oil. Oop. Connect that in there. No one way this way, one way that way. So then we can do a separate line. That goes through to here. And up to here. And back again. And that will literally just do crude oil. Cool. Okay. Um, I think that's ready. to have vehicles put on it. So if we connect this through here, do a double slip switch, do a non one way, Probably get away with a series two four six for the tank car at the lower end of good, um, but then we'll probably need uh, BRs for the rest. So if we put that on onto line eight, line eight will be. Utilizing both tracks on these two. It's literally just connecting up those, uh, that crude oil. The rest needs a lot more, like gondolas. Gondolas all the way through, really. And um, flat car with side stakes. So we're going to need a fair amount of train for those ones. So if we do gondola first, put that on number seven, we can do maybe flat car next. So we need 48 million. So we literally just need to wait for that money to come through. Oh no. Well, I tell you what, I think what I'll do is I will put those on between episodes. So. I'll let the game play out so that it can actually make the money and then um, I'll add those on and that'll be the only changes that I'll make is to put those trains onto those track. So that's a flat car side state train and a box car train so it's ready for the next episode. But other than that, I think we're all done here. This episode has been pretty long and we've managed to connect up a fair amount of different things. We've also been able to uh, improve the connection through for Hailsham and things here, so that's that's good. Um, 
but yeah I'm gonna leave it there thank you for watching uh, let me know what you think with your thumbs and if your thumbs don't cut it let me know with a comment cheers goodbye